story tonight, a violent robbery on a BART train leading to frustration and outrage. After this, that victim, an American, an Asian American woman, simply on her way to work. We've done this so many times tonight. The Asian community, the leaders there, desperate for answers yet again. NBC Bay Area's Terry McSweeney picks up our coverage in San Francisco. This is what's causing the shock and outrage tonight. Pictures of this Asian American woman, her face bruised and swollen. The victim, whose name has not been made public, was riding BART toward the 16th and Mission Station about 8 this morning when a man approached her. What I heard from her directly was that um, somebody walked past her and said, give me your phone, expletive, and then proceeded to pummel her face, you know, and her head and grabbed her phone and her belongings and, and ran off. BART police are not describing the attack and robbery as an anti-Asian hate crime. We're told that expletive used was not a racial slur. Still, the attacks with Asian victims keep piling up nationwide and here in the Bay Area. My first reaction is not again, and we need to do something about this immediately. Cynthia Che is with Chinese for Affirmative Action and wants victims like this woman to know they're not alone and help's available. Let's make sure people who are victimized, who are survivors of violence, get that full range of support and that we remove any barriers associated with that. We are told the victim was taken to the hospital, treated, and is resting at home tonight. But Max Leung says when he wakes up in the morning, he's going to be checking to see if there's been another attack. As, as with all of these victims, you know, they're, they're, just, they're, they're innocent. You know, and no, nobody deserves this. In San Francisco, Terry McSweeney, NBC Bay Area News.